Alhamdulillah. Hallelujah. Allah Akbar. Charged. Oh, bismillah, you. I think it's charged. It's a little bit difficult to see. Okay, and then this one. This thing is broken here. Gotta go through stuff. Okay, it's charging now. Okay. Okay. put the pack on it's going to hit that I might forget it maybe I should get the pack now Taking that off while I was praying. Okay. Set now the yeah. we have Quibla, my God, who does not need any partners or teammates or in growing groups, then how can God be my God? You need to go outside, Mecca. Okay. Such as motherhood, having to tend to children and keep things on a schedule.
way too fat. Wow. Akbar. Akbar, are you reminding me the sisters have the baby canals by putting your nose in the boot, huh? Maybe that's what you're reminding me of. Your baby canal back there, huh? Is that what you know about? In and out of the boot. <sighs> ah, you need grooming. Akbar. This should have gone in sooner. Assalamu alaikum. How are you? Cleanliness is half of faith. I heard you say something, but I couldn't quite make it out. Sorry.
It shouldn't be an award for who is best practicing Islam. It should be an award for whom is most involved, who is, who is carrying forward public needs, interests, and problems of Muslims. Oh, Allah, thank you for the public meeting room. May there be enough food on everybody's table. May there be enough room in everybody's house. May there be enough clothes on everybody's back. And may there be enough savings for every rainy day. Is there any reason we should not leave this area now, Mecca? Is it peacefully happy here? Is anyone else trying to get here? Who did? Did we leave anything we need to pick up? Do we need to leave anything? We need to upload. Wow, it's hard to feel in there. There it is. Okay. Did, um, do we have everybody? You want to wear your harness? You don't? Okay. Or you do. Chris would want you to wear your harness. You want to wear your harness that Chris gave you? Good. Good, Mac. And then we put this foot through the other one. Good. 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 Is that right? Or did I do it backwards? Did it backwards. Maybe it needs to go this way. How's it go? Goes. this it's like it has a twist in it huh. doesn't look right to me son of a 
of a gun, Mecca. Ah! Wow! There, it had to go through half of a loop, not that one, but through this one. Okay, now what? Is this the front? Is this the front? There. Alhamdulillah. Hallelujah. Okay, good. You have your harness. Here's your ID. Good. Okay. Mittens. And the leash. What's up, Mecca? Here's your other leash. This should be in the pack. The computer should be in the pack. Okay, and we get this. And we get this. Good, Mecca. You need grooming. We've got to have the mittens. We got the mittens. We did our checklist. Did we leave things better than we found them? The Ten Commands. When? 
our Creator calls, we come. This is the first and great command, and the second is like unto it. Come together, walk side by side, heal. And the third command, honor thy mother and father. Seek entrances and exits for all, so that none might perish, but find eternal next. And the fourth command, thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's house, nor thy neighbor's wife, nor shalt thou covet thy own house, or thy own wife, but seek to open our houses to prayer five times a day, even if we need to build a national capital to be able to welcome and make more perfect. And the fifth command, keep holy the Sabbath day. See the cars out there, Mecca, going back and forth across the mall? The ice is melting, it looks like it's warming up. We can go outside and pray today. And the sixth command, thou shalt not steal, ask, Do you have anything you throw away? Can I sweep up? Would you give me some? And the seventh command goes with the second amendment. Thou shalt not bear false witness. The right to bear arms and the duty to bear true witness. And what's the Eighth Commandment, Mecca? Um, Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain. Keep the chain of positive reinforcement between you and your ultimate principles and realities open. And what's the ninth command? Assalamu alaikum, Hagar. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Alhamdulillah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You remind me of Hagar, the um, Pharaoh's slave concubine that he gave to Abraham after he accidentally married Abraham's wife, Sarah. Okay. Have you read about that yet? No. Why do I remind you of Hagar? Because you're beautiful and you look like you're from Egypt. You're welcome. You made my day. I'll read about her tonight. Hopefully she's a positive figure. Yeah, she, her son, Ishmael, okay. helped rebuild the oldest house of God. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. What's your name? I'm Bill or Mohammed. Catherine. Pleased to meet you, Catherine. Pleased to meet you. Have a blessed day. As unto you, Catherine. Good luck. Good luck. What's up, Mecca? Good, Mecca. Good. Good, Mecca.
Hi. Girl Scouts, how are you? Welcome. Are you having a good tour? Perfect be friendly, Mecca. Uh, this is Mecca, an Afghan hound service animal. It's so cute. It had a little bag. It had a little bag. Oh, yeah, I see it too. It's adorable. Oh, you are so cute. We try to not worry about who's a girl or a boy till we get to puppies. How are you? And Mecca is too young to have puppies yet. Uh, that's another one we try to avoid because of age discrimination. How old do you have to be to get a single engine private pilot's license in the United States? I don't know. Take a wild guess. 35. 10. Wow, 35. you're optimistic. 35. 35. You're conservative. Who's eating coffee? 2. 16. 14. Can I rob her? Uh, if it's okay with your adult. Hi. Yeah, it does. Hi. Uh, you're welcome. May God accept our efforts. How old do you have to be to be a Girl Scout? Uh, five. Four or five. Four or five years old, you can join? Wow, I didn't know that. I thought that was brownies. You have to be... <laughs> Kevin McCarthy. I try to remember to make an appointment. We, tr we try to have it so if you pass the test, then you qualify pretty much independent of how old you are. What's the test to get into the Girl Scouts? I think you just have to be honorable and true. Honorable and true. Well, the more tests you can help us develop, uh, like your merit badge system, I guess, is based on a form of testing. Then, uh, like I was saying to the uh, right to life people here, uh, if they want marijuana, then they have to lower the abortion rate every year. So the more kinds of things like that we can develop together for response, proof, proof of responsible behavior. In a, in a non-threatening, in a facilitating learning, we're not here to make sure you fail, you know. We want you to pass and we'll work with you. Yeah, you're welcome, who? Bismillahi, open to the one, 100% independence, the one self-sufficiency, who or why needs no key, who or why needs never leave.
here's another one. Hi. Daniel Boone, Stephen Austin, Texas, yeah. We need to invite the president of Mexico to Texas. So, uh, have a dual citizenship campaign. Make sure you're a good citizen in Mexico as a pathway to legal citizenship in the U.S. This is Mecca? Mecca. Yeah. Can I get a picture of you guys? Sure, it's a free country. Help protect it. What's your idea of fun? Hi. Good. Cool. What kind of dog is that? Uh, an Afghan hound? Afghan hound? Yeah. Uh, Do you have a dog yourself? Or? No, I have a cat. Oh, what kind of cat? It's a black cat. <laughs> it's my girlfriend's cat. Ah. Uh, he's frisky, though. And he attacks people. He thinks he's a dog. Huh. Gets in the shower when you turn the shower on. <laughs> uh, plays fetch. Cat plays fetch. Wow. Well, um, the moving truck says to keep dogs and cats separate. Uh, but some cats get along with dogs fine. Yeah. Well, enjoy your stay in the cat. Yes, uh, on to you. Uh, are you having a good visit? Yeah, yeah. What's your dog's name? Uh, this is Mecca. Mecca. Yeah. All right, cool. Thanks. You're welcome. Let's try the appointment desk, Mecca. We forgot last week and we're so excited. Is this the appointments desk here? Wonderful. I'd like to make an appointment uh, to uh, uh, visit the office of the um, Majority Whip uh, McCarthy up the hallway here. Okay. Can I get you to step back out there behind the main desk there? Okay, yeah. And uh, you don't actually make the appointment with me. Okay. You have to make it to the office and then you'll send us down a letter saying that you're coming in at a certain time and meeting with them. Do you have a phone here I can call them on? Um, yeah, you can use this phone if you like. Okay, great. All right, a directory and everything. Hi, Mecca. Thanks. United States House of Representatives. So this would be the screen wall webcam telephone directory and here's some screen here i wonder if i can get that number and get on that screen <laughs> rethink Emergency assistance. Huh, it doesn't put the first two letters of the prefix in the book. Good luck if you're a stranger and you've crawled over here through the smoke and you're trying to dial. Maybe O is enough. Yeah, maybe that's why they don't have the 27 in front of the 4 or whatever this is. 275. People's assumptions. They think everybody knows the prefix. There's plenty of room, they could have written it. Maybe they're afraid people who don't know enough would find it out. Here it is, right here on page two. Ah, 
Uh, it didn't work. No, I dialed 286. It only shows three digits here. Maybe that's the room number. It has all these numbers here. They okay, this is the table of contents. So if you turn to that page, you'll find the info. Oh, how stupid could I be? Thanks. It's such a short thing, I would think, why make me turn the page? Mm -hmm. I guess I'll find out a lot of other information by going to here and seeing all the other offices that are in the same category. <laughs> sure enough. Floor assistant, chief of staff, member services, staff assistant. Deputy Director of Floor Ops, Communica, that might be a good one, Press Aid, Press Aid might be good, I saw Ace today, close to Aid. Scheduler might be relevant. Hello, uh, this is William Hale, also known as Haji Mohammed Omar, calling from the appointments desk in regards to scheduling uh, an appointment to meet with the Honorable Kevin McCarthy. Uh, regarding a peace treaty for um, uh, Syria, Iraq, and Iran. If possible, please, uh, I had a copy on me last week. I tried to pop in and uh, ha uh, offer it to you guys on the way out of prayer, but a U.S. Capitol Police officer in the hallway said, nope, uh, you got to make an appointment. So. Um, Yeah, you guys had your flag up yesterday, I guess, and uh, it's sort of that time of year when you're getting back in touch with constituents, so I can understand. When might the congressman uh, be back in this area, or maybe I should meet with, well, that's the first question. Okay, I can try to slog through that one. Uh, one moment, please. Uh, is the press aid in today? Is the press aid in today? Okay. Okay. Ready. is moving around. I only have one hand. I'm sorry. Dot gov. One moment, please. Allah Akbar. Drop everything. Let's go to page two here. Allah Akbar. Okay. K-R-I-S-T-I-N. Dot my I. 
dot uh, Thompson at mail dot house dot gov. Is that right? Okay. Uh, should I give you my email in case Kristen wants to send me something in the event that I don't get to uh, send an email in the near future? Or uh, W H A L E one two three four five at gmail dot com. Subject line say. Um, Kristen or Treaty. Thanks a lot. Likewise. Bye. Maybe I should have told him what the treaty is over the phone. I should write down that number and call him back next week and tell him what the treaty is. Hi, Mecca. Get so used to put it in writing. Uh, five. Well, as long as you're laughing not at the person, but with them. Okay. Okay, I see how that works. So we started off with party lines when the telephone was first invented. Now we're back to party lines with Twitter. Distillation of Mediterranean seawater via pipeline to the headwaters of Iraq across Syria to Turkey. Yes, sir, can I help you? Uh, Mecca. No, it's not good to have to show ID. It's a graven image system, and that's the first commandment. Here's the phone. Pick it up to have them tell me it's okay for you to go up there. That's the way to do it. I guess someone could capture the guy and torture him and get enough information to pretend that he was the real person and fake their way up there, but then we're willing to take that risk. Well, we get emails verifying everybody that comes in the store, but there's different levels of security, and I work with the sergeant at arms office, so ah. there's a lot of things that we need to do to make sure these buildings stay secure. You no, know, we shouldn't be too safe. There should be enough risk left so that the men and women risking their lives are not taking more of a risk than we are here. We don't get elected or appointed to get free from risk. We do it to accept a little more risk to help everyone. Therefore, no IDs to make the system work. Only the metal detector, maybe two extra ones, so you go through three times to get in.
then instead of a whole wall of dead soldiers' names over here, we might have one or two names of people who got assassinated in their office. But all those other people wouldn't have died because we kept the system open. Big difference. Guns are okay, but no ID. ID is a graven image, and that's the first commandment. Thou shalt not use graven images ahead of the scientific method, the logic of God. I Isn't that right? You can be more succinct if you speak in the imperative, but then you should say, is that right to be humble? Here, I've got to change things, Mecca. Let's stand here. supposed to use that. Surly! S-U-R-L-E-Y! Surly Bicycles! Four inch wide tires, bike anywhere. You're in the army. Bismillah. Ready? Allah Akbar. Alhamdulillah. Allah Akbar. Bismillah, what's up? Yeah, surly bikes on the back of the Jeeps. Bike carts haul up to 600 pounds with your bike. But we need improvement on the cart so you can push it when you can't bike it up the hill.
How did they aim those cannons there at the Jackson statue in Lafayette Park? Shovel! Here are the bikes. Hey, who? Alhamdulillah, hallelujah, I gotta change my external memory. Do not lay on side, must ship upright. Delicate electronics. You got to keep moving, Mecca. How come it's breakable? How come it's breakable? Because it's cold? How come it's cold? It's supposed to be cold. Good. I should have done this sooner. Workflow. Good. Alhamdulillah. Hallelujah.